Hello, Cricketers. <laughs> Welcome to Cricketing with Delanda. It's me again, Delanda. Not going to be on here long. I just wanted you to know my heat press has arrived. I am super excited and there's not much more to say about it. I'm going to go through the unboxing and show you the design that I made using the vinyl that came with the heat press because they, you know, 143 vinyl is having a sale. Look how cute this is. Stick, stick around. Hopefully you can see it, how cute it is. Stick around and see how I go through and unbox this heat press and show you the settings and show you how to work it and so show you why I love it. And that's it. There's nothing else to say about it. I love it. This is, I would give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, and make sure you stay for the end of the video because I will be sharing my code with you, my discount code. I am a direct affiliate with 143 Vinyl now and I'm super excited to be working with them. All right, so without further ado, let's get into the tutorial. Okay, I have it out of the box. I had to get, had to call in some reinforcement. So, all right, I have not plugged it up yet because I just want to make sure. Okay, it says handle to open. What's this? The upper platen. Um, this part gets very hot. Do not touch and keep out of reach of children. Um, I'm reading the the diagram page. Pressure adjustment knob is this okay circuit breaker switch okay i guess that's power switch even though this model includes an automatic off timer when idle always turn off unit when not in use i am uh, um i do like to sometimes i, I am impatient but i also don't want to mess anything up so i kind of read the directions all right, it says thank you for purchasing. Screenshots below. All right. Okay, so it just um, shows like the, what the main display shows. There's a temperature setting, P1. Pressing the set button at the bottom left changes to the P1 setting. P2 timer setting. Oh. Note this is only a timer setting and you must manually raise I like that. So you can have different. Okay, okay, okay. All right. The only, the big difference between this one and my other, I had the um, 8 in 1 swing out heat press. And I mean, it's a good heat press. That one is still a good heat press. The only reason I wanted a new heat press is because I wanted a clamshell. I don't, this is my workspace right here. And so I don't have enough space to be swinging a heat press out. I want to be able to just do everything in one spot and not be worried about moving the machine back and forth, up and down. Um, so that is that. Let me get this plugged in. And we will see. Ooh. Okay, all right. Made me a little nervous. Okay. I'm very nervous. I have a shirt ready. Okay. Oh, when you close it, you really have to close it, close it. Okay. Let's 
This is to adjust the pressure. Oh, I like that. That is better. That's a better pressure setting for me. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna see. We <laughs> we are going to see how this all works out. Let me get my design that I already have ready, and I will do a quick press on a shirt. I'm just using regular um, HTV. It's actually the Starcraft Soft Flex um, HTV because when I purchased this heat press, it came with a free um, bundle, free fall bundle of the StarCraft Soft Flex um, HTB, H mm -mm. not HTB, HTV. So I will get my design and my shirt ready and I'll be right back. Okay, so according to the temperature setting for the StarCraft Soft Flex, it should be set, the temperature setting should be 285 degrees. So I'm gonna follow this guide okay and i'm going to press um set Hold on. oh it's sensitive okay and which is a temperature setting using the up and down arrows you can adjust it okay so i need to go down to 285 okay that beeping will annoy me I'll check and see if I can turn that off later. Okay, and then P2, pressing the set button at the bottom left again, changes to P2. And I need it for 10, I'm going to do 10 seconds. I'm actually going to do 8 seconds. Then P3 is Celsius or Fahrenheit. I want it on Fahrenheit. Pressing the set button again, change the P4 setting. Okay, that's for, um, oh, that's to do auto off. Okay. Okay, the main screen displays the temperature of the upper heat press button, present present value, P value. There's the PV it displays the current temperature, set S value. Okay, so it should be going down to 285. And while it's doing that, I will be preparing the shirt that I'm going to use. I'm using a is this George brand shirt that I purchased from Walmart, just the white. Um, this is a poly blend shirt, so it's cotton and polyester. Let's see. 65% polyester, 35% cotton. Purchased these um, when I was trying sublimation for the first time and I didn't want to waste a lot of they want to waste money they want to buy an expensive or a high poly count shirt and not and, and mess it up so I just want to try a cheaper shirt all right what I'm going to do is just let my sh press my shirt really quickly just to give it some heat what I already love about this heat press is that um let me move it back so you can see what I'm doing uh, what I love is that I don't have to swing it out if I want to have, you know, my workspace over here off the camera that you can't see. Um, I have all that space and um, I like that. That was the reason. That was the main reason for purchasing this one. Um, so I love that. I'm just going to press it. Just do a little quick. Five seconds. I have to work on that pressure setting. You see, it shook my whole phone and the table. <laughs> Not crazy about that. Um, but I know I need to just adjust this knob. Okay. So this is the design 
that I'll be placing on Okay, so let me move my light a little bit closer and just tell you that I love that heat press and I love the way this came out. I love, love this HTV. This is, um, these are some of the other sheets that came in that, that bundle. So it was like seven sheets that were 12 by 12 um, and it came with all these colors. Um, one thing I have not shared is that I am a direct um, affiliate with 143 Vinyl now, and they gave me a discount code to share with you guys, and that code is GET5. Um, and if you use that code when you make your purchase, you will get 5% off your purchase. And um, so that will be awesome because I know a lot of you like to shop there and I also like to shop there, obviously. Um, and you could get a bundle like this. I'm not sure if they still have that special going on, but I'll put the link down in the description for that bundle um, just in case you are interested. All right. Uh, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for um, watching my little tutorial. I'm not, I wouldn't even call it. I want to turn it, but I don't want to mess it up. But you can hopefully you can see. I love that heat press. I still love my other one. I'll probably use both. I think that is my one, two, three, fourth or fifth heat press. Um, we won't talk about it. Okay, thanks so much for joining me today and thanks for watching. Bye.